everyone. So today I'm going to teach you how to make homemade Christmas cookies. This is a secret recipe that my mom has used since I was a little kid and they're the best cookies ever. So I'm actually going to share it with you guys. So I hope you like it. It's perfect for Christmas. You'll feel like just a little homemaker. I'm literally like the perfect housewife minus the husband and the kids. You're going to need eggs, but just one. So as you can see, I cook a lot and I have lots of eggs. So I'm gonna use one egg. You're gonna need one giant mixing bowl. Pink is really important because it makes it so much happier. Like pink gives you endorphins and endorphins makes people happy. You need a half a cup of softened butter and I love this butter because it's, I can't believe it's not butter, which is not real butter, so it's healthier for you. And then, you guys, here it is. The Holiday Funfetti Sugar Cookie and this is the most amazing thing Ever. So I'll teach you guys how to make it and it's a little complicated, but I think after a while you'll get the hang of it It's just like practice. Um, okay, so the first thing you want to do is just pour everything in there Like this and Like it's okay if the bag falls in there Like it doesn't you're not gonna bake the bag, you know get that in there. It's so pretty It's like red and um, green like Christmas. But if you're like Jewish, you can bake these too because they're funfetti for the holiday. They're not just Christmas. Um, okay, then you're gonna take your egg and to crack an egg, all you do is like do it on there like that and then like open it. And like whatever, a shell gets in there, like who cares? And then you're gonna do the half cup of butter and you're gonna scoop it in there like that. It's like really, really cute actually. I feel like such a little homemaker doing this. Okay. So whatever. You make a mess. It's fine. You just call cleaning ladies in the morning and they'll come. C-O-M-E. So then you have it in the mixing bowl. And then you kind of just mix it. Like you can have a mixer, but like who has those in this tan age? Um, so I just kind of stir all these ingredients together. Okay, guys. So here's where the secret homemade recipe comes in. Now the box kind of just gives you the ingredients like I told you, but here's my little trick. I put another egg in, crack it, and then I put the rest of the butter in. Because it's, I cannot believe it's not butter. It's not real butter, so you're not gonna like give a heart attack to anybody, it's fine. My mom used to make this for us all the time and I'm 25 and I still haven't had a heart attack, so I'm just gonna like dig it in and just take all the rest of that butter out. Look at that, yum. Fabio used to promote this butter and that's the reason I buy it. It's actually perfect when you make your own cookies because by stirring, you're actually working out your arm and I think a lot of people don't realize that. Like a lot of people are like, ew, cookies are so fat, but if you make them, you're burning up all the calories. So you just stir and stir and stir. All finished. So once you beat that mix, you're gonna preheat the oven I push bake, and you're going to preheat it to 375. Don't forget to push start, otherwise your cookies won't bake. Now you're going to take a non-greased cookie sheet, like this. I got it at Target, but you can get it anywhere. Now, taking your batter, you're really going to just scoop, like, little dollops of it onto here, like this. And it's really thick, so use your fingers. So gooey and sticky, I love it. These are the sexiest holiday cookies you'll ever make. Your family's gonna like love you for it. So just take your fingers and really get in there. It's totally fine, like who cares, no one's gonna know. You're like a little Betty Crocker, sticky fingers and all. Next step to do is put the cookies in the oven. Now to do this, you just simply take the handle on your oven and pull it down. You'll feel heat from the oven, but it's totally normal. If it's not heated, your cookies won't bake. So you take the cookie sheet with your non-sticky finger hand and you place it in the oven like so. And close the oven. If you want to see that one more time, you just take the handle and push it up. I do it with an open palm. Until it's latched close. Sleep well, little cookies. I'll be back to check on you soon. After 15 minutes, time's up. Time to get those cookies out and in your tummy. Don't forget to get a mitt. I think that's what it's called, and a square. And you're gonna open it up again like I showed you earlier and take it out with the mitt. Close it with the little square and you've got 
perfect holiday cookies. They look so wonderful. But wait, they need to be decorated. I don't know how to decorate. Hmm. Who should I call? <gasps> I know. I'm here for the rescue. Hey everyone, thank you for watching my tutorial. And if you want to see me decorate Trisha's beautiful, amazing cookies with all the frosting, make sure you watch it on my channel because I'm going to decorate all your cookies and maybe eat them too. And I love ilovesexy.com for providing us with these sexy Eskimo clothes because yes. you can't bake and decorate without it. That's like the number one thing you need. So check out I Love Sexy if you're into Eskimos or Eskimo gear. Until next time, here are my kisses for my little baby fishies. Mm -hmm. Bye guys.